Okay. Okay. All right. I am cool with whatever, dude. Yeah. Enthusiastic. We, yeah, yeah, dude. I love. Me and Nick might commentate it. for a bit. That'll be a good time. All right. <laughs> All right. Go for it. Welcome, welcome to the setup. It's great to be back to the setup. So we've got Liam. How was your trip here? Was it, was it frantic? It was a little bit frantic. I couldn't get a park, so I had to park across the river, and I had to briskly walk. I had to haul ass, haul ass, haul ass, haul ass, haul ass, haul ass. I had to haul ass. Crazy, crazy. Do you watch much of Phantom, my dude? I watched some of the vods. I was at work for the. Uh, for the show? Day. Yeah. Davin did incredibly well. Very proud of him. Would have been nice to get a reset in Grands, but you, you know. Yeah, I mean, Sora is really good. He's pretty good. I feel like even at, like. Even even without. Like, sometimes Sora, like, really practices for tournaments, and sometimes he's like. Yeah, look, Spud's not coming, so I'm not gonna put it all in. And even that version of Sora is, like, very, very good. Yeah, yeah. Not to take anything away from Davin, but I I think Sora in the in the Fox Cheek matchup is very, very good. And Davin did very well against a lot of Foxes. He's in the chat, bro. Davin, you did very well against a lot of Foxes. I think the Foxes of Australia should have watched my Fox against your Cheek for some tips. Ooh. So suck my son is in the chat. <laughs> I don't think he is. I've, no, I've, like, seen him in my chat once in my lifetime. Yeah. Because those were some spicy uh, Fox Sheik games that we played. I know that Sox trying to like get some moth going, actually. Yeah, I feel like uh, once you pick up a secondary, you forfeit your right to complain. And I also think Sock is like sustained by complaining. So it'll be an interesting <laughs> career development. But he's not sustained by complaining. He just speaks his mind compulsively, which is a good trait, I think. It's very humanizing. I feel like it, it comes with uh, being a solo Fox. And also being young. Yeah, no, I agree with that. Being driven, being passionate. Yeah, I think. Oh. What do you think of the Lemons Fox? He, was pl he played it against me in the bracket, too. Yeah, Actually, he's playing Fox now. He was always a Fox. I think yeah. I mentioned this to you last tournament. Yeah, uh, I, I think he's days. always been a, a Fox main in his soul. And he doesn't really view the game in like a controlling space kind of way. He's more of a, like, how can I approach? Yeah, yeah. How can I, I, was I hit him? Yeah, I remember that conversation. I was thinking about it um, because... One of my fondest memories was when I first showed up to a tournament and Liam was playing Fox, impressing all the veterans. Yeah. It's always good when a newbie oh. comes up and uh, impresses the, the old guard. Ah, uh, that was so close to being a death for, for Big Ruben. Oh. Speaking of character choice, what do you think about Ruben's Oh! oh. Too high percent, actually. What do you think about Ruben's choice to go Falcon? I know he wasn't looking that flash in the Samus Fox matchup earlier. You might have seen on the on the stream. I think either way, he has a pretty good lock on this match. Yeah. Um, but I think Lemons would have a lot harder time playing against Samus as a as a fox again. Definitely. The thing about Lemons picking Muff all that time was his reasoning for it. it was um it was like, oh well, you know, I don't really play, I don't practice, put that much time in. It's like I should play a character that has like. Uh, better, you know, input-output kind of value. Yeah. I don't but know if that's strictly true. I think Fox has amazing input-output value. I agree with that. Like, if you can get away with the bad necessities with Fox and get great results. But also you get kind of owned if you, if you mess up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I've always believed that, and I feel like if you're playing melee, you should at least have, like, you should be able to show up with Fox, you know? Yeah. Like, I, like, people like to point out, like, the execution barrier of Fox or whatever, but I don't think it's that high to get a lot of value out of his character. Especially in NTSC, where Up Smash is just so valuable. Yeah, he's obviously uh, has a high execution requirement. But I also think it's, like, kind of mitigated by the fact that he has so many escape options. And he's got, like, one of the best recoveries. Like, Falco's execution is, like, slightly easier, but he's, like, way more burned if he, like, puts himself in a bad spot than Fox is. Oh my god. Oh, oh no, he's gonna lose it. To shine. He's gonna lose it. Lemons takes this. Rightly so. Yeah. Off with his head. 
Also, Ruben's uh, using Jeff's controller today. Yeah, he wasn't looking that flash against me. He kept missing uh, Zaire sweet spots. Oh. I think once or twice in the set he did it. Which probably is just a different Ready? controller. Go. Oh, that's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Just like doing the dash dance grab and getting the butt grab of Falcon. What do you think about forward throw at the ledge, though? Just strictly still bad? Uh, I think down throw is good because if they DI in, Big you obviously get a, a D, and if they DI out, it's kind of similar to forward throw. I guess if they're DIing out, then forward throw might be even better. Ooh. It's definitely better than back throw, I will say that. I don't know why this character just has such non-functional throws, but I guess you can't have them all. I think fourth throw like to throw them off stage is pretty good. Oh no. You get scared. Oh <laughs> That's so dumb. Oh How has that happened twice in one match? Like for that to happen. Nangs had to do the worst chill grab. <laughs> Did you hear uh, Peter Dutton has coronavirus? No, but that, that's hilarious to me. I heard it at 6 p.m. when I was finding a park. It was breaking news, and the Triple J presenters were like, <gasps> No way. <laughs> Just audible gas. Kind of crazy. Especially given the recent, like, Scott Morrison still going to the footy business. This country, man. Oh, I hope he falls through. I really hope he falls through the stage now. Yeah. It was looking like it for a sec. Oh, that was good. Good coverage. Whoa. Lemons, you gotta do something after you nair. You can't just nair and do no shame. At least dash back. Oh, that was nice. Insane. Big hitbox. He drifted, like, to the left as well, so it was pretty, like, a lot bigger. Yeah. Oh, that was a shine. Definitely a hard call out on which way Lake is going to recover. Because if he'd gone at him, he would have just lost. Oh my god. Get absolutely yeah. red, kid. Ruben's playing pretty nice with his Falcon right now. I actually have always, like, I've liked uh, watching, playing against, and uh, experiencing Ruben's Falcon as of, as of late and in his original entrance to the scene. Yeah, I think when I first saw it, I was disgusted because it had like no neutral game at all. But it's definitely improved a lot. Yeah. What's a matchup you think he wouldn't pr bring it out in? Uh, I feel like he's just been using it pretty like as a utility character when like I Samus can't do it. I feel like when the chips are down and he has to beat a spacey, hmm. he's gonna pick Samus. Like in a major, especially. Maybe yeah, a that's, local, pick Falcon, that's but probably fair. He's not going to pick Falcon against you. I don't know about that. I don't think he would. Like, not in a high stakes match. Like, maybe at a local. Like, going to back. Ready? Go! <laughs> We've got crabs in chat like, for Peter, for Peter Dutton. Very nice. I'm actually. My, my favorite thing out of everything, the current event. Oh, that was so sick. That was good. My favorite thing out of the current events is just going to the shops, seeing the full empty aisles of no toilet paper, and then making eye contact with another shopper, and just like both like, you know, like looking at each other in solidarity of like, ah, yeah. th th these are the times we live in. <laughs> yeah, Hilarious. It's, it's pretty bad for like, your confused 80 year old pensioner who gets to go to the shops once per week. Yeah, I and mean, like, oh like, shit. like everyone loses though. Especially because old people are like the people who are actually gonna die. So yeah, yeah. If you're actually like an old person and you would have to go to the shops to like prepare for being quarantined, it's very gross to like not be able to find what you're looking for. There we go, Liam. So smart and skillful. Why did he counterpick into Pokemon Stadium? <laughs> that was like one of the worst counterpicks ever. Yeah, you could have taken him to Yoshi's. Yeah. Took it, taken him to FD. Oh, so smart. <laughs> that, oh, probably yeah. that wouldn't have knocked down if you didn't get that bad, oh, by the way. three up smashes. <laughs> oh, no. Lemons is actually picking it up. He's yeah. mixing it up. 
Just the seventh fire soul in a row. Really mixed them up. <laughs> I mean, I love a player who loves to just stall. Yeah. Hey. Ooh. <laughs> oh, no, that's it. That is actually... Oh! Oh my god, let's go Leo! Yeah, if it was Sock My Son, he would have done a jump tech play me and uh, survived. I mean, he survived anyway, but... Only Damn, Liam's nice. Yeah. Liam kind of nice. He do be on the sticks looking kind of nice. Oh. oh my god. Oh that my god. Actually amazing shine. No. I, the down air was like super sick on the edge guard. I feel like that's such a good move against the RP because of the refreshing hitboxes. Yeah. Alright, last stop. This Ooh. is where... Liam looking like a Fox player. Through and through this whole time. Oh no. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, he. What's happening? Uh, what's happening? I think some oh, like good serious chunks are happening. I think he just full hop three times in a row because he couldn't muster up a short hop there. <laughs> like, it seems like that kind of full up. <coughs> I went to my housemate's fringe show last night. Oh, what Insane. was it? Uh, it's like a, it's called the Family Friendly Circus. Basically there's one guy who's like a fire spinner and does a bunch oh, of fire, fire related content. And then Lewin, my housemate, he just yells loudly in an East London accent about like whatever. And then like pretends to snort cocaine and then gets in a sword fight. I know I spoiled the, the plot, but it's also finished, so that was the last show. Pretty good. I like it, honestly. Oh shit. Yeah, I mean it was, really made you question what a performance really is. Which is what I like out of I love the fringe. fringe. I love the fringe so much. Oh no. Lemons. Lemons was looking so good for a sec. Oh wow, and Nangs doesn't homie stock. I guess he just takes those. One's enough. <laughs> One game is enough. Yeah, Lemons just needs to get a bit, a bit better on that defense. Yeah. Just needs a little bit better tech habits. Um, one thing that uh, Ruben actually... Ooh, okay. Crazy. One Insane. thing that Ruben actually mentioned to me while I was playing his Falcon one day was just like, sometimes you do just actually have to roll. You are forced to roll against uh, Captain Falcon. Like that. There you go. Yeah. Um, like, sometimes I really just didn't know what I needed to be doing to, like... Get away from this this fast man. He's a quick boy. But rolling is sometimes the best option. Let me just kind of bring this back, honestly. Yeah, he threw away the last box, so this is like money as for him. One oh, thing I like to do against, oh, he's looking so cash money. One thing I like to do against some Falcons is like, I'll wake up and I'll just like full up Nair at them because they're trying to like cover my like wake up option with like a Nair. Mm. And if I just, they're like not reacting to the thing, they're just like trying to cover the rolls and then like cover the next thing with a Nair. So I'll just jump over Yeah, them. yeah, right. Which would have oh. worked in that specific situation that happened. That was such a decisive moment for Liam. He had. Falcon waking up in the corner, and he he decided to hold center, but because of that, he doesn't capitalize on the sock that could have been his. Oh, but he's he's looking good. Could just get grabbed and need here though. Off stage, good decision. All right, now he's starting to flub the tech skill. I feel like Lemons is one to make move decisions that are just like very hip, very trendy, like forward. End. And he just wants to break the mold sometimes. Yeah, he's, no, not, he's, I mean, he, I think it's because he understands, yeah, yeah, I think it's because he understands that, like, oh, sick poke. Um, I think it's because he understands that, like, well, I may as well, you know, like, I am just, I sure do be just competing at the locals. Yeah. Also, I think he understands that he doesn't know the guaranteed flow does. Yeah, that too. All right. Oh, damn. That's probably it, actually. Wow, just A no valiant. Respect. No a respect. Valiant effort. No respect for Lemon's ledge guard. Ledge dash, sorry. And uh, rightly so. I think it's us, actually. Oh, it is. Winner's finals time. Alright. Goodbye, stream. Good luck, dude.